we see more of ourselves in the media. Hey everybody, Deborah here, also known as Dubich42. A little my take on what we see becomes what's in our head. I am a, how we put, shall we put it delicately, person of size. I'm a fat chick. I have been for most of my life. Even at my smallest, I was still considered kind of a fat chick, okay? That's just the way it is. I've come to accept it over the years. After much fighting with what I call the bitch in my head, we all have that inner voice that talks to us and tells us, oh, you're not good enough. You're not pretty enough. You suck. Well, my bitch and I battle it out all the time. I'm getting better though. Stronger. Faster. Oh, wait, sorry. TV show. But in the media, all we see are basically about 5% or less of the population. Now, I'm not saying it's wrong for them to be in the media. You know, those folks that look like supermodels. And I'm not even talking their airbrushed versions. That's another problem entirely. But we see in the media sort of the ideal, and I use that word speaking the air quotes as I say it, because ideal for what? These people are, they're super thin, they're beautiful, they're uber fit, they're gorgeous, they're sculpted, but they're not everybody. Now, do I think that we should just put, you know, 7 million clones of myself on TV? No. For one thing, we wouldn't all fit. And for another thing, that would be boring too. Why do we only see the fat chick as the funny one, if you see her at all. Why are uh, Asian people so underrepresented in mainstream media? I don't mean just around the world, talking mostly about American media because, well, hello, I'm in America. We have a large Asian population, especially in some cities. Why aren't they represented on TV more and more than just a stereotype? that's something else as well. Why aren't we seeing more strong black characters, not just the stereotypical so-called ghetto person on TV? What it's up to is us. Every one of us, whether you look like the supermodels or not, demand that we see everybody, flaws and all, Every magazine ad does not have to be airbrushed to within an inch of reality because, oh, they are. Even the models will tell you, uh, they make me look that good. If you were to see some of these, you know, supermodels, beautiful people on the streets, unless they were done up like they were going to that photo shoot right then, you probably wouldn't recognize them. They are within Photoshop or some other photo manipulation program, not trying to be brand specific here, they are shaped, tanned, untanned, sculpted, reduced, stretched. It's not them anymore. It's fun every now and then to find um, someone who photographs and does not do that stuff to their models lets you see what people really look like. Because you know what? We don't have Photoshop in our mirrors. We look and we see what we are. Good, bad, and whatever. Have found a clothing company that I mentioned on Good Stuff Mondays that does just that. They are for everybody. Now their, their slogan is, um, all bodies are good bodies. Yes, whether or not you are perfectly happy with everything that you've got. I don't think any of us are. Would I like to be thinner? Yeah. Would I like to be more fit? Yeah. Is it going to happen today? Probably not. Will it happen eventually? Maybe. But I'm not going to stop living my life or stop myself from beginning something just because I'm not where I think my ideal should be. I did that for a long time. And 
it's time to not do that anymore. Live. Don't say you'll start living when you lose 20 pounds. Screw that. Live now. If you lose 20 pounds on the way, great. You were living on the way, having fun, doing stuff that you enjoy. That's what I'm trying to do. Is it a struggle? Yes. You know what? I bought a bathing suit for the first time in many, many years the other day. I tried it on. Tried not to let, you know, that bitch voice in my head get to me. I realized it's a two piece that looks like a one piece. I'm very long in the torso and one piece is make me kind of have to scrunch, you know, gives you that weird wedgie snuggy thing. Don't like it. But I got a little two piece, looks like a one piece and the bottom has a cute little skirt. Didn't like the way the top looked very much, but I never liked the way my midsection looks and stuff. But I was able to say to myself, Ooh, that little skirt looks cute on me. I'm making progress. I'm trying. By the way, now that I have a swimsuit, hello, somebody open your pool and invite me over. I want to go swimming or something. Just not in the bright sunlight. Swimming in the evening, maybe? I don't like getting crispy. Anyway, live, enjoy, take control of your life and your perception of yourself. And if somebody's looking at you and telling you that you're not good enough and you're not pretty enough and, or whatever, kick their asses to the curb. Keep positive people around you because you're better than that. See you next time.